Hey y'all, I'm Lindsay from The Smart Single Mom. Welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be showing you how to create outlined text in Canva. So uh, I'm gonna share my screen real quick so that y'all can see what I'm doing. Okay, so now we're inside Canva. I'm gonna go to create a design and we'll just start with a Pinterest pin. Okay, so another one of the little limitations of Canva is it does not have great text effects. So it doesn't have an automatic ability to click it and outline the text or add a drop shadow or any of that. But there are some little workarounds that you can do to do this. So if we go um, add a heading, and I'm gonna make it a little bigger so y'all can see what I'm doing. So here is our heading. And we're gonna go here to our fonts over here on the side, and we're gonna type in outline. When you type in outline, you're gonna see some fonts over here that are available in a outlined version. So uh, like if we chose this rig solid or this, let's use this Londrina right here. So now you have outline text, um, but this one, if I change it, it's the color, it's only going to change the color of the outline. So it's not filled right now. It's just outlined text. So let's say that I want to be able to change the color inside the font here. So what we're going to do is we're going to copy and paste that so that we have two of them. Okay, so there's the second one. And with the second one, we're going to change the, the font over here. We're going to search for Londrina. And we're gonna find the solid one, okay? So you can see that there's a solid and then there's the shadow or outlined one. So choose the solid. So now you have the solid one. And this one, you can change the color of the solid. Let's say we want red. And we're gonna line them up. Um, now I wanna bring that one to the front so that my outline's in front of the other. I'm gonna zoom in a little so y'all can see this better. Okay, so now we have outlined shadowed text and you can see I can move around the outline separately from the solid part. So you line them up like you want them and now you have outlined text. This one actually has a drop shadow too. It comes that way. Um, and there's a few different ones, you know, when we were looking at uh, the fonts over there look at a couple of them. So we go back to our fonts, we hit outline. You can try out a few different ones here. There's uh, this one, Siphon, it's kind of cute. So if we take that, copy and paste it, so we got two of them, go back to your fonts and search for that. And so there's the regular one, the filled one. And we'll make it this pink color. And so then we're gonna line them up. We're gonna position them right. We're gonna send that one backwards so that the outline's in front. Now, sometimes this does happen. When you have um, an outline text and a solid text, sometimes they don't line up just right. Like you can see one part of it's a little bit off from the other. Now, I'll say one thing. Um, sometimes you can just kind of move it around and get it closer to what you want. Sometimes it doesn't look bad to have it a little bit offset, um, depending on where it is. But if it's a big difference, the thing that you can do to fix that is to mess with the spacing a little bit. So if you mess with the letter spacing, this is going to bring your letters closer together or further apart. And you can kind of play with this until you get it lined up exactly where you want it. And sometimes that will work to fix it not lining up just right. So that looks pretty good. Um, so that's how you can quickly and easily create outlined text um, in Canva. So it doesn't work for every font. Obviously you have to search for the outlined fonts, but they do have you know, quite a few different choices for different types. This one right here. Obviously there's more with the pro version, but even with the free version, I mean, you can see there are 
a few different options here that you can choose from. So yeah, that's it for today. That's a quick, easy way to add an outline to your text in Canva. I hope you like this tutorial. Be sure to subscribe and thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time. Thank you.